Now we want to get to the incredible close call caught on camera. You see it right there, that plane at the top of the screen there. It crashed on a busy Clearwater Road. It's just hard to imagine being on that road and seeing that this happen. Terror. ABC Action News reporter Adam Weiner is live for us this morning on Keene Road, where the pilot and the passenger, Adam, walked away uninjured. Yeah, kind of really a miracle in a lot of ways. You can see where this plane's path took it. It went through this tree into that uh, that uh, road sign right there and then finally ended up on the side of the road going through a small fence right here on Keene Road. And you can see in that deputy's dashboard camera video, the plane kind of wobbles as it gets close to the ground. The pilot says he was just trying to get back to the Clearwater Airport. He was coming from Zephyr Hills, but you can see how close his plane came to cars on the road uh, and some homes in the area. This is, of course, a residential area, even almost hit a bike bicyclist, she tells us exactly what happened to her. It's scary, first of all, because I thought it was coming right at me. And plus, it's a very busy road. I was afraid he was going to hit another car or something as well. Um, so I'm just glad that everybody was OK. Now, the pilot, Mark Benedict, he tells investigators he was having engine problems on this small fixed wing single engine plane, and that forced him to crash land. If there's any good news this morning, besides, of course, that him and his passenger on her, it's that they've cleaned up the road here, so there's not going to be any mess in traffic wise for you on your morning commute. Live here in Clearwater, Adam Weiner, back to you.